Hello viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel Victory 365 Days. Today we'll uh, have spoken English class. So in spoken English plays a vital role in our day-to-day -day life. There are many ways to speak English fluently. But for that we need good preparation and thorough knowledge of how we deliver our speech. That's what spoken English is all about. For that you need a good preparation. So in this uh, aspect today, first most important topic today we discussed that is called spoken English self introduction. Introduce yourself. So introduction may be of two types. Formal or informal. Informal means where you can express your uh, hobbies, uh, some uh, interesting facts, uh, something like that. When it comes to formal, official, you need to present thoroughly and up to your uh, knowledge. So that you impress the others. So for that, some key points I have written here. That key points you must uh, prepare. Okay, generally people what they think that uh, self-introduction is all about uh, by heart or uh, scripted one or unusual way they try to speak. But it is all about speak about yourself what you feel, express yourself so that the other person understands about you. So for that you need to prepare some key points that's what we discuss in today's video. So first of all see what is a self introduction formal so about yourself you inform the others about yourself so first point you should remember greetings so the gathering those who are gathered there so greet them with good morning or uh, whatever uh, situation it demands as per that gathering maybe uh, you are facing interview so it may be uh, good morning to gentlemen ladies and gentlemen like that then second point is your name age and where you have come from okay your name you should mention so how you mention i am rahul i am 32 i have come from andhra pradesh mumbai delhi whatever your place name you should mention that is what the first important thing after that your family background in that particular formal uh, in self introduction might not required next you come to the other point that is your qualification okay your qualification i am msc graduate uh, from so and so university you can express okay or you are supposed studying i am studying btech third year uh, from annamalai university so that you should mention your qualification next up is your experience have you worked somewhere that experience you should inform i have two years experience one year experience in so and so company as a sales manager or a sales executive whatever you have that experience you have to mention next thing is what why do you apply for so you are applying to that particular post is also plays a vital role okay why you apply for generally for your uh, maintenance your or your uh, earning or your employment so these many factors you should mention because that's what plays a important role okay why do you apply for okay is it your necessary or you do you have interest in that particular organization or institution that really forced you to join in that company so that's what you should mention okay in your so i want to join this company because i uh, have come to know about this company's uh, well uh, organized and it is always uh, uh, my dream to work uh, with this company because this company has so many features that's what you explain next up is uh, are you deserve then you mention that are you fit for that particular job do you have such kind of qualification do you have such kind of experience knowledge so that they might take you to that job that's what also plays an important uh, role okay yes i am deserved to be because i have such a kind of experience so i am sure that i'll do wonders for this organization with my 
experience like that you mentioned last step is your assurance then you assure you then you promise and uh, then you assure them that you you are hard working uh, person and you do your best of ability to bring laurels to that company and you make sure that you will never uh, disimpress them at any cost okay you do your best to bring good name and fame to that particular company so this is what your self introduction in a formal way whenever you face interviews or uh, any for official purpose jobs then you use such kind of key points you should mention what are those greetings first you greet hello uh, good morning to everyone next is your name age and place i am rahul sharma uh, i am 38 i am from uh, mumbai next is what i have uh, qualified uh, btech or uh, i am graduate in msc from usmania university then you come to your experience i have 5 years 2 years 3 years experience in tata motors as a sales executive or i have worked in so and so school for 2 years as a uh, faculty of physics or mathematics like that then you uh, inform you them about why do you have applied for you have applied for because that uh, renowned company's name and uh, you are uh, dream to work in that company next is uh, are you deserve yes i am deserve to be applied for this post because this is my qualification and this is my experience so i am sure that i would be able to work with this company with best of my knowledge last is your assurance okay with my knowledge and my experience i am assuring you that i'll do my best to bring good name to your company with my sincere and hard working nature this is what you inform during your interview and main point is what your body language should be uh, very good your body language your appearance don't feel shy okay so whenever you feel a little bit uneasy wait for some time then you speak out it's all about your expressing your views so there should not be any confusion or doubts or something but before that prepare well and uh, see many examples how to uh, express yourself how to introduce yourself that's the important key point prepare well and go with confidence and uh, impress them with whatever may not be you selected but make a mark over there that you have such and such skill but because of lack of uh, vacancies or something other reasons they might not take you but you should make an impact on them that this is the way body language your way of talking the way of your standing your appearance this all are so important so before that practice well and go with confidence this is what in this video today we discussed about self introduction in a formal way whenever you face an interview okay i hope you like this video do subscribe my channel and keep watching for more and more updates till then have a nice day bye bye